know. I think you might just have to go down and talk to him. And then... Open the chest. Climb back down. Seems simple enough. Oh, she's here, yeah. Oh, now the wife is there. What the hell? She's unconscious. Are they about to battle it out? She's like ready. She's in battle stance. Get out! Get out! Please, Carrie, my darling, listen to me. You brought me here. You did this. Do not interfere. He's coming home with me. Calm yourself, Shade. We can resolve this peacefully. Another one who wants to control me. He called me here. Trapped me. Because you're a crazy a bitch. What the fuck? Boy. I only wished to explain myself to make you see how... No! Enough of your whining. Enough! Selfish, arrogant bastard of an artist. I wanted to be left in peace. Yeah, he told a woman to calm down. Zara, what have you learned in your many years, huh? Of of being alive on this planet. That's like one of the things you just don't do if you want to live. <laughs> yes. Just just calm down. Come on. All right. Like Zara has never spoken to a woman before, noted. <laughs> can can you just speak normally? Don't raise your voice. Try saying that to an angry woman. Mystic Carrion was the one behind this. It wasn't Oscar's fault. I'm here because Oscar wanted me here. To make him feel better! Oh, my sweet Carrie. What did I do to you? Save your tears for the ethereal plane. What is going on here? The first one is oddly sexual. <laughs> Jokes on you, yeah, I don't talk to one been there, done that. How did it go for you, Frost? I almost, almost. didn't survive it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I thought so. I thought so. Yeah. The Carrie Oscar spoke of was kind and gentle. This isn't the real you. Also, you talk to Meepsai. You don't have the, the argument is invalid. What are you saying? You're trying to confuse me. It's so hard to think. I don't remember. Carrie, my sweet meat. My sweet meat. <laughs> I, I just need to know that what you did, wow. that it wasn't my fault. Why am I here? I shouldn't be here. I shouldn't be. The spirit's aura flickers, changes. She is confused, lost. Dragged here unwillingly by a man who refused to let her leave. Mm, okay. I won't let your soul be bound unjustly, spirit. Tell us your fate and you will be freed. Who? Me? Fine. If 
Oscar wants the truth. He can have it. We were a fling, nothing more. My decision had nothing to do with him. I did this because I was so fucking sad. All the time. Oscar me. finds it easier to imagine a world where women kill themselves over him than one where they have their own bloody problems. I'm sorry, Kerry. I had no idea. But I... I was truly not to blame. No. You weren't. So you and your poxy paintings stay away from me! We're done, Oscar. Over. Now let me rest in bloody peace. That's better. God, what a mess I've made of it all. My sweet Ferelia. I've been a rotten fool, haven't I? And yet you never left my side. It will take more than a ghost to scare me away. Though I wish you'd come to me sooner. What a giga chat of a uh, wife. Uh, huh? I was expect I was yeah, giga chat of a wife, that's true. But I was expecting I was gonna make a joke about how Frost would have liked this ghost and then I turned to look at chat and he beat me to it. Yeah. She's gone like every woman in my life. What is wrong with you guys? Uh, at least you'll have great story to tell your grandchildren perhaps not i think this sorry episode is best left out of the family history though it was quite the adventure such torments i put you through my love but even at my worst you never left my side i'm so very sorry Janeth deserves more than an apology for what you put through to. A debt I'll spend a lifetime repaying. As for you, my noble friend, our account can be settled far more quickly. Come upstairs to my atelier. I promise you'll leave with something priceless. Immortality. Let's go. I hope he means the fucking painting to capture you and your face. I mean to a and to live be great. Immediately you, li you live uh, in in the art, you keep living on. No, no. Something like that. No, no, no. I, 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 no, trust me, that's probably what it's going to be. Trust me, bro. Trust me, bro. <laughs> he kind of looks like XQC, it's true. That is actually true. <laughs> We are at the atelier. Atelier. Huh? What? Where the thigh is at? What? Here he is, the atelier. hero of the hour. Brushes are oiled, the canvas prepped, and you... Well, you're comfortable. That's the main thing. So, shall we begin? He said he wanted to say you're you're beautiful, but then he looked at you and he reconsidered. Something wrong. There's something wrong with what I'm wearing. No, no, no. Of course not. As an artist, <laughs> I want to capture your true essence in this portrait. Bloodstains and all. Oh, of course, if you do want to freshen up first, I'm more than happy to wait. After you all, want water? It will be seen by generations. I have, to come. I have create water. Uh, Ross, don't hurt me like that. The worst color would say you. 
Yeah. I am happy as I am. Well, Wonderful. that works. Stand yourself just there. And... See, I told you. And voila! <sighs> All it needs now is a name. Ew. Ew is the name. <laughs> Capture the spirit in which it was Please, Kylark, this is your moment to shine. Please Bully. chime in and be like, I would say we can call the painting you. My name weren't on it, to be quite honest. Heroic and modest, then this shall be simply the hero of Baldur's Gate. A title I don't doubt you'll earn in due course. Please, take it in for a moment. It's not every day one's face is preserved for posterity. Now I prefer the real thing. Yeah, what did you just say? <laughs> Excuse me? Did you get a painting? Oh, you did. Uh, no, what? Yes. Scald Supreme, a raider extraordinaire, master of modesty. Oh, and how fetching a face. Flawed, flawless, elegant, hideous, paint pleasurable. It seems to fit all such descriptors and many more besides. Like, ew, what do you mean hideous? Examine, you can't even, what? I'm sad. Being bullied. You're not being bullied. It's a, uh, you're Leaving everything. <laughs> oh, tire. <laughs> Humph. 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 How can I leave her? I got a lot of stuff to clear, stuff to clean up. That's true. Um, oh, we didn't. Hey, Mr. Dorman. <laughs> you took the chest. Okay. I don't think it did actually. No, but it says open. Maybe. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I can. Oh, what the hell? Sorry. Missing out on precious loot? Uh, art show schedule. Were we even here? I don't think you were even here. Indeed. The plans for a forthcoming art show at House Janna. Strange tide. Self-portraits from the Sword Coast. Blah, 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 blah. Golden no, chair. Okay, Mr. Mailbox outside. Orders for staff. Is that the same as the staffing duties? For if the below is unclear, bring your concerns to Mr. Mercer, Menemonis, Furbelstun, Serving, Bailey, Shine, the silverware, and be careful about it. Cyrilla, wash the linens. Julie, speak with Chef Mordram. Fubs, greeting guests. Did we go down here? Yeah, it's just, just the ground floor. Yes. Oh. Uh, how do I leave there? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, it only shows the painting after placing it. Enter, so Excuse me. If that is your wish. Personally, I would advise. Too late. Simple letter. Dearest Fifi, I write hoping you received word from Oscar at last or made any. Oh. Or made any. So mad. Why? What does it look like? <laughs> So mad right now. Oh 
Oh my god. What do you mean? Why though? Yeah, like, he literally talked oh. to you. I need some alcohol. Uh -huh. Is that a bug? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's RNG based? Oh my god, dude. No. What the fuck? Out of all the people. Oh my god. Should have been called you. Time to re- yeah, time to reload. Uh, I've not made any headway at all it asked his whereabouts. I've known you for too long and believe you're not tossing and turning at night over his absence. You must be worried sick. Do let me know as soon as you hear anything. I promise I keep any news, good or ill, in the strictest confidence. We both know how the ability of to go gossip. With love and concern, Maria. Letter of apology. Madam, please forgive me for my inability to clear your fine house of what haunts it. Though Lathander's light is mighty, it, like all things, has its limits. Have you tried Saloon? She thrives by night, and believe me, your house is deep in night. Best wishes, Dawnbringer of Wong. Well, we did it. We fixed it. Cellar thing editors keep out some interest. Uh huh. You've scouted so many times to get Shadowheart. Understandable. Understandable. Humph. Humph. Hump. Oh, I clicked it. Fix it again? Okay. There's definitely a door behind here. Oh, yeah. That's curious. That's curious. Click. Maybe the other side, too. Yep, other side, too. That's curious. Hey. Hey. Oh, this is to the thieves, then, isn't it? do this we used to we used to be careful with these what happened where did it go wrong you very well that's what red Ew. okay okay I'll go up again my god hi hannah i don't know what to do without final fantasy 14 me neither i get it i <laughs> totally understand it's like you i don't have final fantasy 14 and then he like want to log into Let's Final see. Fantasy XIV to get through the maintenance and Final Fantasy XIV isn't up, right? And then you realize that you can't do that because Final Fantasy isn't up, so you can't waste your time in Final Fantasy XIV waiting for it to come back. I think about it too. Right? Yeah. Right. Mm. Yeah, and I, I don't understand why they can't just use the main character that like talks with the guy for the portrait squeeze their guts out of their ears like an overfilled sausage mm -hmm. i think we're about, about to find more of shadow heart story mm -hmm. because they're talking about shadows oh. oh mailbox alert there's literally <laughs> nothing in there I'm so sad. So sad. I am upset. Viv livid, even. Greetings. Do you seek help? No. You are in the right. Inner peace, the path to perfection. A self-help book dis suggesting all depressive woes can be cured by drinking the oil of freshly grown olives. 
Dude, if it was that easy, bro, like, I would be ordering pizza with just olives. Everything. You're supposed to. Also, ew. Maybe I need more what, pockets. ew, with uh, olives? Yes. Why, ew, you don't like olives? Not at all. Just absolutely horrendous. What? Wait, what? The surprising habits of Karaturian warlords. A curious self-help tome that claims to help those who have disappointed their elders. It seems to have been hastily printed and bound and strikes an oddly harsh tone. Alas, poor reader, not everyone can improve themselves without the help of others. Some need the instruction of an elder, a steadying authorita authoritative hand that can mete out guidance and discipline in equal measure. Honor your elders, dear reader, be, care be mindful of their lessons, deferential to their desires, and grateful for their discipline. Be of service to them even when you think you are at odds with them. The book drones on, dispensing suspect advice, suspect advice that advocates for utter obedience before imploring the reader to seek further help at the house of grief. Sounds like a scam to me. Give me the wine. Respect the alcohol, boys. I like how this one up here is stealing and the other one isn't. I'm just What did you do? I can't like to sleep for a bit. Oh. Understandable. Hmm. I still need to try making Shard a ranger with a wolf companion. Oh, come on. Hello. 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 The House of Grief welcomes you and stands ready to ease you. Welcome to the House of Grief. Are you here to be unburdened? Whatever ails the heart, whatever weighs upon the soul, we can help. She's pretty. Do you trade anything? Your soul. But... but. Nothing of importance. Unburdened, what does that mean? We release people of the suffering in their hearts. Melancholy. Anger. Self-doubt. Troubling memories. And of course, grief. I think you could benefit from our help. In fact, I think you desperately need our help. Uh -huh. I sense turmoil in you even if you cannot bring yourself to admit it you seen me <laughs> like all right i want to be unburdened there is the matter of the fee a trifling sum can don't scam yourself you. Rest assured. Oh, dar. wonderful let oh. the healing begin <laughs> First comes the mapping of the heart. You will be asked questions. It is important that you answer as truthfully as possible. So that we may know precisely what burdens you the most. The mapping will take place uh -huh. in the next chamber. Please. Right. Yeah, right. This is like when you call one of those like religious hotlines and they're like, I can I can make you speak to your ghost the, the to your deceased the ghost grandma. But From and then you call ghost. and then they're like and then you need to before you get into the actual show, they're like, Yeah, you need to like wait, hold up, wait on there's so many books to read. What are you doing? Why are you so eager? What the hell? But then they like you have to give them all your information and then they go through your Facebook or something and then they tell you like who you are and why You're and supposed to guard the door. No more slacking, or I'll report you to her. To her? A detailed budget breaks down the closest income and expenditure. In one column are listed items such as donations, book sales, and profits from sale of memories. What? 
The next column includes supplies, bribes and informer, fees, poisons and rare substances and more. Next one, paltry offering in the income column. An angry note has been added in elegant script. Unacceptable. The dark lady's church cannot thrive on crumbs. Do better or be replaced. V. Uh, they're fucked up here. Become our friend. Sounds okay. like there's gold mm -hmm. inside. There's also a book in here. Yep. Their proceeds? Uh -huh. An application form inviting members of the public to become a friend of the House of Grief. Several tiers of donations are outlined in return for benefits such as having your name listed in the thanks section of their next publication, bespoke calming tonics, a plague in your honor, and even a complimentary session to be unburdened of your woes. The amounts of gold start modesty but cl soon climb to stagger amounts. It's literally Patreon. What the hell? Client list. Alaric Whitmurth, Melancholy Heart, Paid in Full and Referred for Unburdening, Elvir Sunbury, Craven Heart, Paid in Full and Backed Out, Partial Refund, Ludric Croms, Jealous Heart, Paid in Full and Referred for Unburdening, Jackwell Iron Thumbs, Prying Heart, Paid in Full, Had an Adverse Reaction to the Mapping of the Heart and Fled, uh, No Refund, Marco Cren, Possible False Name, Curious sword, not local by accent. Black hair, pale complexion, prying heart. Paid in full with unknown gold currency and was referred for unburdening but fled. Note Mother V has ordered we seek out this Marco Korean if possible. During his mapping, she detected thoughts and memories of strange lands and unfamiliar people fixated on a sword or possibly Zord? What? Mother's V Mother V's interest was piqued. She wants that mind. She wants that mind? Update, the trail has gone cold. It is as if he vanished entirely. Cleona, Frostly, Violent Heart, Paid in Full and Referred for Unburdening. Arvis, Silvermount, Melancholy Heart, Paid in Full and Referred for Unburdening. So, Unburdening takes your fucking soul, is that it? Uh, no, but it probably takes your memory. And this is probably a yeah. sure facility. From the quill of the Mother Superior, Lady Shar's sacred halls must be defended at all costs. Ensure that all who are assigned to guard duty or service in a house of grief are aware of correct protocol. Secrecy is our first and best, de and best defense. The house of grief is more than a facade. It's a shield. Maintain it as if your life depends on it, for it does. Two, the hidden pa passage leading downwards must remain sealed unless indicated otherwise on my authority. Hidden passage, okay. Three, should foes penetrate the lower levels, the main hall before the Chamber of Laws shall be our final redoubt. Four, if all else fails, destroy anything that may be of use to Lady Shar's foes. Preserve her, se pres preserve her secrets. Five, do not allow yourself to be captured. Take poison, fall on your blade, swallow your tongue. Do not betray the Dark Lady. This is fine. This is fine. So I think you should go first. Oh, also, no. you can try to talk to that lady since you have Shadow Heart in your party. Oh, yeah. A self help, why did I do this? To those prone to deceit and insincerity. Let us speak plainly, dear reader. You may believe deception to be an art form, one that benefits you more than it harms you, but this is the worst lie of all. The self deception that shall one day be your ruin. How can you break but how can you break the cycle? It can prove difficult to speak the truth when lies come so easily. Instead, perhaps do not speak at all. If you cannot be honest, then at least you can be silent. Uh, I'm gonna talk to her. I should speak up. Welcome to the House of Grief. Or perhaps welcome is the wrong word, Shadowheart. Oh, boy. There's been some debate whether you'd even show up and face the consequences of your actions. I assumed you'd try to flee. Like a craven. Spare me your venom. I'm sure the Mother Superior will have plenty of her own. All in due time. Let us pass, question mark. Can I fuck this up for us? Uh, let us pass. As I said, in due time. First, you submit to the mapping of the heart. Only then can we know what is to be done with you. The mapping of the what? <laughs> this is the house of grief. We strive to help those whose hearts have grown heavy. Be it with anger, melancholy, grief, or 
treachery. Submit to the mapping and reveal what lurks in your heart. If you consent, follow me. If you do not, leave. Oh, now she's Same. coming down there. You can just follow her, I guess. Have a seat. The mapping will begin shortly. Telling you to sit, I guess. There's the secret door. Oh, yeah. Probably open if you sit. There's a book. I need to read the book. I can read. Oh. read. A guidebook written to assist newcomers in grasping the separation of upper and lower parts of the city of Potter's Gate. Uh, describes the upper. I think we've read this here. If you're on YouTube, congrats. You can now pause and read it. Uh, habits of patriarchs. I think we might have read that as well. I'm just gonna lay down. Oh, or sit down. Oh my god, what was that? You seek to be unburdened, yes? Hi. The mapping of the heart can reveal the way. Yet, there is another here whose need is great. That voice. And now me. I think I'm supposed to do this. Go ahead. Do you know why you are here? There is something I lost. No. Had taken from me. My family. My life. I want it all back. Loss is a gift, girl. Do you still not understand that? Now give me the true answer. What is your purpose in being here? What's going on? Is this part of the mapping? Why map what is already known? A disloyal heart. A craven heart. A shadow heart. Now answer. What is your true purpose? The artifact. I was sent to retrieve it. At any cost. And who tasked you with this mission? The Mother Superior. Of Sha... It's you. Give me the honor of my name. In full. I... I can't. My memories... I know what's in that head of yours better than you do, girl. My name. Mother Superior... Iconia Devere. You still have the wits to recognize your betters. Good. Now descend. You have much to answer for. Oh, did, did she just go invisible? What the hell? So we have some investigation. I wonder what the next move is. I don't know. Come on. Can't give up now. Are you clicking on something or? No, just running towards the place. But it failed. Are we going down? Yes. Why can't I move? Do you do you need to click on the? It's a. Oh. It's a door. Dumbass. Oh boy. Well, so we're here to There's save our parents. There's a fake wall here. So we're here to save our parents, right? I think. Yeah, well. There's dead people here. 
That doesn't look good. It's uh, on the door to this, it says interrogation training, which, all right. Uh, just go down and pick up since I can play. Just pick up the book and then you can read it. Thank you. He's on tight. Mm-hmm. Interrogation in three levels. A manual of Sharn interrogators describing three levels of induced stress, emotional, physical, and lethal. It emphasizes eliciting information over punishment and ca cautions the interrogator against becoming emotionally involved in the process, either sympathetically or sadistically. All right. Another one. Ay, ay, ay. Can you steal the outfits? I will surely try. Infiltration. The purple dress, okay. please. There's a wardrobe. Yes. Books. Oh, thieves tools. Thief tools. And books. Nice. Uh, is there a book? Yeah, and uh, behind you. Oh, there. And there's a mug two. of beer. And there's a and there's also a letter and a gortage. The beer. The beer. Uh, there you go. I picked up the. He doesn't want to get me the alcohol, I cannot believe this. Are we taking this? Mug of beer, there we go. Thank you! Chug. Chug, chug, chug. Okay. Artifact mission challenges. The pages in this handwritten notebook have been torn out except for the final page which was, which was only partially removed. The remaining text reads as follows. Run agents, I guess Sharon, agents in summary must be trained to deal with conventional illithid and githyanki traps, locks, levers, and controls. But most importantly, they must be mentally prepared to face extreme situations under alien conditions. Casualties are expected, but what's that circumstance must not halt the mission. Agents are to be deep imbued to regard mission, su mission success as critical, even beyond survival. Report on activities of Enver Gortash. A detailed report from a Sharn agent, Dark Adept Bilvoy Reed, about the activities of Enver Gortash, an arms smuggler the Sharns had, in, uh, had des designated as person of interest. The report concludes with the lines below. Gortash, whom we believe to be a follower of the tyranny Godling Bane, has recently been consorting with a leading adherent of the murder godling ball the pair were observed entering the devil's fee where they conferred for over an hour with the establishment's proprietor the known diabolist helsic this must be considered significant as helsic is reputed to be able to open gate portals to the house if her extravagant fees are met well did you click on the outfits on the mannequins Yes, nothing happened. Sedge. Well, you go first. Can't slow down. This is shoulder hold things, so. Mm hmm. This where are these things? Uh, there's a book here. The Unburdening. Hey, there's nothing. The volume describes the full process of unburdening in exact detail. Valuable targets are identified from those who seek out the services of the House of Grief. If they are willing to pay, they proceed of to the mapping of the heart, where the inquirer of grief will question them while discreetly probing their thoughts for anything that can be of use to the Lady of Loss. Following this, targets are ushered on 
downwards to stand before the mirror of loss. Given the correct prompts by the inquirer of grief, the target will surrender memories to the mirror for the benefit of all of Lady Shar's children. In the same stroke, the mirror can remove memories of what they have seen in the cloister, as well as whatever they believe to be the source of their troubles. Then they can be turned loose, blissfully ignorant of the offering they made. That's just manipulation. That's fucked up, guys. That's that's fucking with people's brains. I don't appreciate it. Anyway, cloister of somber embrace. Oh my god. Oh, good luck. Thank you. Oh boy. I remember this. Only one way ahead. Childhood spent in this hope for the superior must be close. Soon this boat will be over. Oh boy. Hi. Sentry Fred Rich Frederick Fred Frederick. Keep going. The Mother Superior. The Mother Superior will deal with you. Shut up, tiny man. Oh. Open, Sesame. Um. I'm a save. Good plan. Good plan. We are about to fight someone, I'm sure. Oh boy. We're about to fight a few guys. Punch him oh, to. Oh, they already heard how you disgraced yourself before Lady Shah. I'm how scared. she marked you as the enemy. But it is quite another thing for them to see it for themselves. I am very glad you decided to return. A cautionary tale such as yours will be studied by Lady Shah's initiates for years to come. But perhaps I can make a case for some small measure of mercy. Give me the artifact. And I can at least make this quick. Enough. I don't answer to you. Not anymore. I'm here for my family. That's right. I know what you did. And it's not going to be quick. This is your family. And now you have turned your back on it. The artifact was your last chance to prove yourself, and you squandered it. Shadowheart has nothing to prove to the likes of you. Such misplaced camaraderie. How about this? Surrender this one to me, now, and you can leave freely, and consider Lady Shah's forces your allies in the battles to come. Never. As you like. Lilala! For sure! Not giving up the wimp. Not the wimp! 